Welcome back to the Talent Gaming, guys. Hey, Orpheus. Yeah, I'll add you on Steam. Just send me a message, dude. Dude. Next time I log in, I'll add you. We're exploring Nosferatu land. It's the hot new theme park. They just opened up in the caves below Los Angeles. Now that you've found here, there's a bunch of uh, new quests that can op are opened up to you. Awesome. Ooh, female Nosferatu. Bitch, I can't believe she got the cover of Glamorella this month. I mean, just look at her. Too fat, big teeth in her complexion. Does she wash her face with a cheese grater? What the fuck is that with this chick? She was pretty once. Oh, is she bitter about it? Like anyone ever knew Oof. who Tawny Sessions was before I left the scene. She'd still be a fluff girl at Vivisection, making ten bucks a stiffy if I was still around. I, I oh wow yeah if she used to be really pretty and now she's this. Oh, that sucks. Right. Yeah. You probably don't recognize me with this whole Texas Chainsaw Massacre thing I've got going on here. My name is Imali. God damn. Yeah, all you guys can send me a, a Steam ad. I'll add you next to my login. Onyx Path says Mitnick has a mission for us. Oh, cool. <laughs> Buddy Black, is this is this the Nosferatu ethno state? That's what Nosferatu like to do. They like to either get people from really high up all the way down to the bottom, or they like to bring people who are all the way at the bottom up a little bit higher. So they just, like, find hot people and turn them ugly? Bear me your head straight, yeah. bullshit. You've got no idea what I'm going through here. I mean, Jesus. I can't sit here and let the world think she's better than me. I've got to do something. Exfoliating? I don't want to kill her. That's too quick and painless. I want to ruin her name in a business for good. I want to dig up something on her that smells so bad even the tabloids will think twice about printing it. Gary says that everyone has to lay low until this thing with the prince cools down. Until then, I'm stuck here watching the whole world kiss Tawny's big fat ass. Hmm. This was one of the hard, the other hard quest I was talking to you. In her oh bedroom, yeah. One in her bathroom and one in her kitchen. I'm sure you'll see good places to hide them once you're there. Okay. You're just sneaking. Once the cameras are in place. You'll need to hook them up to the network. Log into her computer using the password Cleopatra. From there, you'll be able to activate the cameras. What's in it for? Who cares? Me? Sex, drugs, bad hygiene. Everyone gets a little dirty when the door is closed. Tawny's no different and probably worse than most. Sex, drugs, and bad hygiene. Which one is us in private, Naomi? But listen, I don't want her dead. I want her to suffer. Bad hygiene. Get in and get out without her knowing about it. Understand? <laughs> For which one of us? Both. <laughs> Fine, I'll do it. Let's do it. You will? Great. Here are the cameras. She lives in Hollywood, an apartment building right across from the Lucky Star Motel. I had someone here dig up a spare key to her apartment for me. Take that. <sighs> Excellent. Thanks. I'll take care of it. Let's do this it, man. Will... Not yet. This, that one's... Do that a little bit later. Probably not even tonight. We'll probably be uh, out of Get here another Garrett episode first. or two. Because, frankly, I'm ready to about blow my... I, there's a blood pack on the... <laughs> you say, were you going to say blow your brains out? Oh, you, did you already grab it? What are you talking about? No, there was a was blood pack red, on so. on the box. Did you grab it? No. No. It was just a the weird red. Oh. Uh, maybe I'm just seeing things. I mean, probably. Yeah. That sounds like something you'd do. You know, I just okay, talked to her. Probably. Mitnick has a quest too, but you haven't met Mitnick yet. Yeah, he did. He's the computer guy. Oh. Guy, can they, can these guys repair their place, please? Nope. Yeah, that's where. Gary is. Ooh, it's the big doors, eh? Chinese theater doors. Oh, is Gary Chinese? No. Oh. He just likes fancy doors? Yeah. I mean, everything's made up of things that's thrown away. That's what it looks like, eh? Mm -hmm. It's garbage everywhere. It's like a bum town. 
by the clack smack cracking of my thumbs, something wicked this way comes. Um, I don't remember seeing you on the guest list for the dinner party. What the fuck? We're having a rap party for the misfits about 40 years late. Cast and crew only, boss. What? Where are you? Maybe I'm in your head. Uh-oh. You might have picked up one of those psychoses so common to new kindred. Oh, wait. Onyx Path, so high. We're Onyx Path Publishing, the current publishers of the Vampire the Masquerade tabletop RPG that Bloodlines is based on. Cool. They're in the chat room, Pixel. Hi. Hey, dude. We're playing this game because Pixel we Precision, uh, a viewer of ours, has, has sponsored it. I've never... I've never oh, shit. Like, neither of us know, know anything about Maybe vampires, so this is actually our first introduction to it. You really like it so far. Yeah, it's really cool. Or did you ever stop to think that your fear, if given a voice, would sound like this? I don't know, boss. You tell me. Bring back the Ravenous, pretty please, heart. your party. You should make another RPG. I mean, I know that you guys are tabletop I'm publishing, but on Karn Sarkoff. Maybe, maybe figure out Wait, to make a sequel boss. of this because this is actually a really good game. It's better than RPGs like ten, like that are ten years newer. That's right. I know you work for the prince. Just tell me about the Sarkoff or whatever. My own voice. It's not every day we get visitors, boss. I needed to hear it from you. You're a long way from home, and neither the prince nor Isaac nor Nines have any domain down here. Hmm. Tread carefully. Oh, there's a werewolf game coming out. That could be cool. Yeah. Werewolf the Masquerade Bloodlines? You should have mm -hmm. got here no, sooner. No, just werewolf. That lot's been hmm. sold. I like to discuss business face to face. Sure. Are you sure, boss? You don't want my image in your subconscious. It's the stuff nightmares are made of. I'm actually just really impressed with this game. Careful what you wish for. He's not bad at it. But... Might get it. Is he gonna like startle us? <laughs> Be like, ah! Yes. Behind you, boss. Boom. Boom. Oh, it's this guy. Haven't we met this guy before? What? You don't recognize me from the pictures? Gorgeous Gary Golden? Don't tell me you missed Pirate Town or Tap Hotel. A little before your time, eh, boss? Well, those days are long past. Nowadays, it's just... Gary. Oh, this is the old... Remember we found yeah. him on the yeah. computer? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, this is the, the washed-up actor. Who's been transformed where, into a goop? Where, where did it go? That thing seems to get around more than May West. Why might I ask? Should I give you Focus Home Interactive and Cyanide Studio putting together a vampire game? Cool. Because I got rid of the Chamisi. Oh, my hero. Had it not been for that damn Chamisi, you'd still be searching under rocks for us. It was hardly a favor, but. I know where your prince's prize is. There's very little that doesn't leak down into this place. Tell mm. me, boss, you ever gone up against a Quay Jin? Haven't we? We, we fought them. They were like the, the big boss of Santa Monica. What's Quay Jin? The Quay Jin are vampires, but not like kindred. Sometimes known as the vampires of the East. But they ain't kin, boss. They're just someone else that, if you ain't being careful, might give you the final death. Ah. Yeah, we did kill one back in I Santa killed, Monica. I yeah. think I killed one. Even for old Gary, there ain't much more to tell. You see, I sent an agent, Barabbas, to snoop around Chinatown, hmm. do a little hacking, make a few oh, contacts. Let me just... Oh but god, been my feet hurt so much. It's breaking my heart. This is honestly I think the worst they've, they've felt in like years. Mm. God damn it. But yeah, That's another a, trip to a vampire sequel would actually be really what cool on Path. I must say. 
best you don't mention my name there, boss. That's the going rate for my like, info right now. The RPGs that came out a decade after this one, a lot of them are worse than this game. This is a really good game. Deal. The only bad part is that it came out unfinished. <laughs> so the fans had to, like, patch it together years later, but it's still great, you know? It'd be more at home in a theme park. That I saw as well. You know what? Go hire the, 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 go, go hire the people that make, that made the fan patch this and make new games. Sounds dangerous? No. A lot of modders actually became game devs. Like, didn't, didn't, didn't the people... Once he's safe, I'll tell you who made like Dota end up making Dota this. 2? Like Dota the World of War or th sorry, the Warcraft 3 mod? Or did they make Le League of Legends? I'm not sure. But basically game modders become game devs not all the time. That I know of. It's like the eye of the hurricane right now. Don't make those winds blow, boss. I hope I hope they're on it, dude. Sounds dangerous. Sounds dangerous. Let's see what I got. Use your head and your eyes. Chinatown's more liable to offer you than ten Hollywoods. But not if you're smart. I thought it was a Warcraft 3 mod, yeah. Forget it, boss. It's Chinatown. I'm guessing Chinatown's dangerous. All right, I'll go. Of course. What kind of a monster do you take me for? <laughs> There is a method to my madness, boss. There's a payphone in Chinatown. I'll call you with the info. Once Only Paris one payphone in all of Chinatown. Then, you'll never know where I am. Oh, is he actually just gone? Yeah, man. Can you just turn yeah. fucking invisible, this guy? I mean, yeah. Yep. You get the power to turn invisible when you're in Osferatu. Oh, nice. It's called... Obs obfuscate. Obfuscate? Yeah. Yeah. Is it called light refraction? It's called fucking magic. You turn to friggin' mist. You said you were impressed with this game? Yeah. I like this game. Yeah, it's good, man. Gee, thanks, well, really? <laughs> <laughs> I'm surprised. <laughs> okay, so... Yeah, Bunny Black, remember the original Fallout 3 and how that completely fell apart? Fallout Van Buren? R.I.P. Interplay, dude. Remember this, this is how you'll get back to them. Okay. Well, you'll be surprised. Uh, we'll, we'll soon get up there. Maybe. Ooh, it's a tiny now little you door. Know where it is. Oh, oh, it's in the mausoleum! Alright, cool. The door with the glowy bits around it. Yeah, could could you activate that before or no? No, I'm sure. I it don't think it would even it would even have an option on it. It would be like one side locked kind of thing. It wouldn't even like if you hovered over it, it wouldn't have a a, a lock or anything on it. It would oh. just be nothing. Obfuscate is mental. It doesn't work on cameras. Oh. Neat. Yeah. It makes sense they'd be slinking about a graveyard, though. Yep. Graveyards are usually not really that populated. Like, if, I mean, you and I went, went, went to the graveyard in my hometown. They're right? heavily and populated. And there's, like, no one there. The dead. Yeah, yeah, there's dead people there. But, you know, yeah, he's still, he's still banging there. I guess that stays closed forever, then. Yep. They, they borrowed a fair amount from Van, from, from Van Buren uh, to for New Vegas because... They hired Fallout 2's writer, was it Chris Avalone, to work on New Vegas. They basically adapted it, but there were still a lot of things in Van Buren, like Boulder City didn't show up. Um, the Fallout, uh, the, the Van Buren prison didn't show up in New Vegas. They, it was it was more of okay. a story adaptation. Before, before we end the stream, there's one quest I want you to do. Sure. Go to um, Isaac. Now that you've found Gary, a quest is unlocked. Excellent. Let's go talk to him. Well, and we're at 15, so it's time for us to take a break anyway. Next episode, we'll go talk to Isaac.